Hey guys, it's Regent here, and today I'm gonna show you how to tame this adorable creature, the Featherlight. So let's go. So first of all, it's a passive tame, and he eats plant species Z seeds or auric mushrooms. I would recommend if you have the uh, seeds, use the seeds because the efficiency is a bit higher. It can be carried only by the human, and it spawns on Valguero, Aberration, Genesis, Crystal Islands. Genesis Part 2 and Fjordur. And the difficulty is 1 out of 5 points because besides the food nothing is hard to get by the taming the Featherlight. So let's start. So if you have found a Featherlight, just take the seeds. There we go and put it in the last inventory slot. And just approach it and press E. I have a higher... Um, Taming rate on my server, that's why it's so easy here. From most of the times we need multiple tries, but we have another one up there. So I can show you something else. You can also use a bowler for it. So if you're scared that it could potentially run away, just bowler it. And then you can feed it on the ground since it's on the ground and it's also already tamed he doesn't need that much food so let's talk a bit about his abilities you see he has this charge above his head this is for his light if we would come down i could show it to you you see he's he has this light on his head and now you can pet it and turn on the light you can now put it on your shoulder and you see it's very bright everywhere uh, but the charge is like it's he's using his charge for that but if the light is turned off on this here the charge will fill up very quickly again you can also auto activate it and one very nice skill is enemy player detection so if you ex uh, use this so if you turn this on it's like a power saw that detects a dino and you can also ma uh, detect max level wild creatures. This is also very strong if you need like high level or you're searching for perfect dinos, you can just turn this option here on and the f uh, feather light will work like a power saw and show you the dinos on if they are close to you. So another thing, if you approach Globox, I will fly up to it real quick. If you approach while well, you have your um, feather light on your shoulder and the light is turned on obviously you can approach Globux and give 500 charge to pet so you can load the charge of your feather light with the charge of a Globux so this is pretty nice to know if you're running out of charge and you need the light and you see a Globux, Globux some flying around somewhere you can just steal his charge and uh, yeah it's pretty nice so that's already the end of the video. I really hope you liked it. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next video. Bye.